Hey there, welcome back to another episode of Winning with SEO here on Revo Reports. Today, we're gonna to talk about your bio. Um, on a lot of sites, like we have uh, Pablo on Zillow here uh, as an example, they give you a lot of fields that you can put information in about yourself, about your business, about your listings, uh, and you really wanna take advantage of that. You wanna capitalize on that. Uh, there's a few reasons. When somebody comes to one of these sites, you're gonna to wanna to make sure they get as much info as needed to call you and for you to, to build trust with them. Also, Google's gonna look at these websites and it's gonna confirm other info that's there, you know, it's gonna check your website and it's gonna to go to your website. It's gonna read your bio. It's gonna look for keywords like we talked about in the past. What does this person provide? Where are they located? So you wanna make sure you get all that stuff. Um, now we'll look through Pablo's uh, here on Zillow and I'll just point out some, some things that I wanna make sure you keep an eye on that, you, that you've done and then you can check your profiles, uh, your bios, excuse me, and, and go from there. So here on Pablo's, um, a few great things. I mean, obviously he's got his name, he's got a great picture. Um, that means a realtor, you have to have your picture, right? So um, a good bio, and now this is a place where you're gonna wanna write up, um, you know, get your keywords in there, talk about what you do, build some trust with them. It's not a ton of space, uh, but it's your opportunity to, to, to show Google what you do and to talk um, you know, potential buyers or sellers into working with you. Uh, Pablo's got one listing going, that's, that's kinda outside your control. I'm sure this probably pulls from the MLS. Uh, one thing here that I'm seeing that's important, team reviews. Um, I assume that these are um, like testimonials or reviews uh, from people that he's represented, you wanna push hard for those, whether it's on Yelp, Google, or, or these kind of sites. Um, no matter where, those are gonna build credibility. Uh, this is great too, having these different service areas. You wanna make sure you have the areas that you're gonna cover so that both, uh, again, both the, the people you wanna represent and Google can see you know, where you're available. Um, also over here, uh, real important, you know, obviously the address information, but Always make sure you can get a link to your website. Uh, we talked about backlinks, I believe, in an earlier episode, and these are the best places to get them. You're, you know, I, I believe when we talked about backlinks, we covered having them on relevant websites. Well, it doesn't get more relevant than Zillow or one of those sites to link to you, so that's huge. Um, if you use your Facebook like you're you know, posting info on, info on a regular basis, make sure that's there too. So, so this is a good example. Um, you know, using the things you've learned on Winning With SEO and bringing that keyword and theme and you know, all those things we've covered in previous episodes. Um, and if you haven't seen those, you know, take a few minutes to go back through them. Each of them are pretty short, two to three or four minutes. Um, and, and make sure that you're taking advantage of your profile. You're building it out uh, and you're building trust with whoever you're gonna represent and you're, you're feeding Google the information that it wants to know that you're the right person for the job uh, and to know what you do and where you do it at. So um, that's it for this week. Check back next week.